Hi, Nicole Casas is asking me, uh, if you could choose a time in your career to have a Groundhog Day experience uh, of the day playing over and over and over again, when and what would it be and why? Um, God, and that is such a hard question. Um, because there's so many amazing, amazing, amazing moments that I would love to relive. But um, I always go back to our first U.S. show on the Blonde Ambition Tour. Um, and that was just because I didn't realize how popular Madonna was, <laughs> honestly. I didn't. I was listening to alternative music and crazy people and you know, rock and roll. And I really had no idea how popular she was. And then when we got to the U S and, and our first show was at Houston, Dallas, um, they turned off those lights and the screams were just insane. And they couldn't start the show because we couldn't hear the music. Um, it went on for so long, 15 minutes, something. It was unbelievable, but just the energy and the electricity of that night. And, uh, and just, coming from nothing like you know a year and a half earlier I had never even danced a step so I was flabbergasted you know and when I first got the job in Madonna I was a, a associate choreographer so I wasn't even supposed to be on the tour I was still in school you know I when we got to Japan I actually then dropped out of school so that I could just focus on the tour but just the the realization of where I'd come from you know, even months earlier where I couldn't even eat and I couldn't even, you know, buy, you know, I couldn't have, I didn't have a quarter for a phone call or, or to fill my tank of, on my moped of with gasoline, a gallon of gasoline, um, to come from that to standing in front of whatever, 15,000 crazed screaming fans doing something that I loved so much, um, and being appreciated for it. It was, such an amazing time. I, I would love to relive that over and over and over again. And I, in a way I've kind of been, <laughs> been aiming at that my whole life. And maybe that's one of the reasons why I still keep performing and still keep dancing. And, um, although I'm, you know, slowing down on that, uh, I want to do my own stuff now. Uh, but I, I just see myself still being on stage because it's just somewhere that I love and I, I want to relive that over and over and over again. So give me more opportunities to do that. <laughs> Um, thanks, Nicole.